Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition with me, Won't Exploits, and you, whoever you may be. Uh, last time I defeated the two bosses, or the boss that was composed of two NPCs, the Dragon Slayer Ornstein and Executioner Smog, however you say that. But I actually made my way back here. There's a couple of things I need to do. Um, there's actually a location here, but unfortunately I killed the giant up above. So he needs to drop his boulder down here. Um, so that you can smash through this wall. And that takes you to a guy that you, t that you can use that key on that I got. The iron cage key. But also there's a couple of items I missed here. Uh, I just made my way down here because I... I didn't want to waste time recording stuff I've already done, so I actually opened this door. I can't remember exactly how I got to it, but I haven't picked up the items yet, so I'm going to do that. There's a couple of items down here. That's the black sorcerer stuff. Okay. Can't really use that. And this leads somewhere. Oh yeah, there's also a place I need to go back to in the... I think it's called Anor Londo Cathedral. That I cleared that place and then defeated those bosses. But there's a, a secret wall where that invader invaded. Uh, thanks to Devil went down to Cory, I think is his name. He informed me that there's a chimney breast. Or there's a doorway, a secret doorway. An illusory wall back in that place. So I'll go back there after this. That's just a large solar. I think that's... Just the two items, is it here? And then this takes us back. I think this is back to the start, is it? I don't want to drop down there. But there's also a crack in this wall, but I have to... I have to die in order to... Let that giant respawn, because I actually killed that giant to get down to this area. Um, which I did before, but he seems to respawn, so he has to respawn in order to drop the boulders. Yeah, let's just back down. I don't want to go down that way, do I? I suppose we can check it out, why not? Oh, six damage. Uh, kind of lost, actually, here. No, there's another item down here, so it was a good idea. Okay, so I'm getting all the items. Good choice to come down here. Slumbering Dragon Crest Ring. Don't I already have that? I think I'm wearing that. Oh my god, so you can get that twice? You didn't have to kill that guy to actually get that item. But yeah, I need that dragon to respawn, so I don't know whether it's wise to die here in order to get that... Not dragon, the giant boulder trucking guy. So I need him to die in order to get the boulders back. Uh, as I said, the only thing I did off camera was coming back down to this area and unlocking that door. That allowed access to the stuff with the iron key, or the... What key was that called that I acquired? from jumping to the tower uh, that I thought was an impossible jump that was in Sand's Fortress in, near the end of this place but that I can go back up in that I suppose I'll jump down here and go back up in the the shortcut there Yep. if I can avoid this massive arm here so I'll have to jump right about now uh, just wait here actually compose myself Take him from behind. I also have to go back to the Farling Shrine to talk to the snake guy. I, think, I assume that would be the, the Squidward looking guy. He's actually a snake. I didn't realize he has a body that goes way down. Well, the first time I saw him, I didn't realize. So this takes us back up. Alright, nice one. Where do I want to go from here? Kind of confused. Uh, what was I going to do? 
So I got those items. I need the Jan to respawn. I can travel between Firelink Shrines now. Which is what I actually did. To get back to Sands Fortress anyway. Or did I? Man, my memory is terrible. It was about a week ago I did that, so... Yeah, that's my excuse anyway. Oh, what's he got? Titanite, always nice. So yeah, that's where I got that key. I just jumped across that bridge. And that's where the giant should be that chucks the boulders. You need him to chuck the boulders to break a wall down below there. But, let me see. I'm going to cut this out because I'm thinking what to do here. So I have three things to do, is it? Um, one of them is break that wall. The other one is, as was suggested, is to go back, yeah. So I'll do that. I'll go back to An Orlando, sorry. An Orlando Cathedral. I could go back via the Firelink Shrine. I think I should do that, actually. So that would be quicker, wouldn't it? Yeah. Quicker than actually traveling there. Because I need to go back to the cathedral, so hopefully I can uh, shortcut it from there, or access it directly from the Firelink Shrine. Wait a minute, am I going the right way? I'm... God, this is so confusing. Coming back this way, because I've always been going the other way. Well, this part's easy. Just take your time. He says, is he... Fuck! No, 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 no. Are you serious? Are you serious? At least that means that the, uh... The giant will be back with the boulders, so... That was unfortunate. Oh shit, I'm back here. This is not, not, not where I want to be, but I can warp. You can't warp to every location though. I can go to Anne Orlando, I can go to... Ah, oh, this sucks. I need to get my points back, that was 20,000 points. It's not that big a deal like, but... It would be nice to get them back. Yeah. I have to go get those back. It's not going to be that hard. Kind of lagged there and uh, got hit with that. Oh, let's take this magician out first. Activate that. Hey, whoa. Okay, this is kind of jerky today. Or maybe it's just me. Getting back to grips. Okay, gotta avoid that. Across here, make my way down to that green splotch. Whoa, is this gonna knock me off? Whoa, get out of there, get out of there. Oh ho ho ho. Right now, go. Sweet. Right, this guy, easy peasy. One shot. Now he's coming. And do we go across this way? I think we do. Let's do it. Can I see my points from here? Where are they? Hmm. Stop. Go. Jump. Yes. Wait a minute. It's kind of disorientating from this point. Jump. Snake guys here. Oh, the boulders are back, so you know what? I might just turn this. I need to turn it so the boulder goes down this way. So if I can move this, I'll move it this way, I think. Or is it the other way? It's going the opposite way, so yeah, it must be this way. I'll push it this way. That should break this wall down here, so I might as well. Yep, that's gonna work. Might as well go down this way. I think I'm gonna get hit by this boulder though. Ay, 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 yep, 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 yep. 
and I'm gonna have to run fast past this guy. Oh right, I know what I needed to do, that was so stupid of me. Why did I do that? All I had to do was break that wall and then move it back. Wow, playing bad today. That was terrible. Just lost my situational awareness. I'll get it back. So I lost all my points there. So at least I don't have to worry about getting those back. But I think, yeah, I'll definitely go to that wall then first. Can I get across here without getting punted off again? These are trickier the other way because I haven't done it this way really. Right, go. Easy, see. Just a bit of patience. Whoa, hi there. You again. This is the reverse course. Now this guy. See ya. And across here. Just wait for them to be right in the middle and run and jump. Oh, that is a close one. A close call. I run and jump over that. And since that's open, we can move this again. So, out of the way. Hopefully, this will remain open. I'm pretty sure it does. So, let's hope so. If we run down here fast enough. Yep, there's a hole in the wall, that's good to know. We get some points back, not as many as I'd lost. I lost 20,000. But I'll get that many back quite fast, I'm sure. So there's an item here and a guy you can free. And this may be a shortcut also, I don't know where that takes you. Hey. Hmm. You seem quite lucid. Yes, quite lucid. Who are you? Logan. Logan? I'm a bit cooped up, as you can see. I have a bright idea. Suppose you set me free. I'm old and empty handed, but I could repay you with no kind of sorcery. This place is melting my mind. The inactivity is repressive. It's kind of uh, insane that a, a one key can open so much. It's a cage key, so it opens all these cages, basically. These hanging cages, so it will open his cage as well. Pretty sure I used it on the uh, one of the gates as well, though. That was closed from the other side. Anyway, let's open this cage key. Used that, so that was that cage key. Now, can we talk to this guy? What's he going to give us? Oh heavens! Thank you. I'm safe. I can't see your face. Oh, there it is. But I must log a few things first, and I will do a favor. I will return to Farley Shrine. Oh, nice. Speak with me there, so that I may impart my sorcery. So we're going to get some sort of new spells from this guy at the Farley Shrine, that's cool. Anything else to say? Oh, hello. Don't mind me, go on ahead. I'll be on the plate. Oh, I'll just find you. Alrighty. Safe travels to you. And there's an item here as well, so can we open this? Where's that gonna take us? I don't think I want to find out right now. Probably back up somewhere. Can I get this guy? Pillage, soul of a hero. That's uh, soul of a hero is a lot of points, isn't it? Where's this taking us? Oh, just a sheer drop. To nowhere. Great. I was actually excited for a new area here. But it was not to be. That tree's kind of flat. Not such a great view. Okay, I'll try and see where this takes me. Nope, nowhere. Okay. Thought so. What about this one? Nope. Okay. I doubt, I doubt any of these go up, actually. Yeah, 
we can open them all though. Haha, <laughs> a lot of tense into detail. In most games you couldn't open every key's key. Because it would only be like the ones you had to open. It's like hand holding, whereas this game does not hold your hand. Which I love. It's like the old school games. It adds depth to the game, it adds realism to the game, because there would be a lot of cages like this that would be useless. And there'd only be one that is actually useful. Or a couple, in this case. If that makes any sense. Okay, where am I going to go from here? This isn't the right way. I guess I'll have to go back to the... What do you call that place? Back to the firing shrine? No, 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 no. Well, back to the campfire at the end of this place anyway. At the entrance of Sands Fortress, yeah. Whoa, nearly fell. Let's go. Stop. Go. Alright. Yeah, this is the easiest route. And then we can warp from there to An Orlando. Whoa, hey. You spotted me. And then I can get the armor from An Orlando that I missed from the chimney. It's like a chimney breast with a hole in it. Or a illusory wall, sorry. Yep, that was bad timing. Luckily I made it. Alright, now we can go back. Take these guys by surprise. Oh, hi there. This guy's behind me. Yep. Just in time. Do those guys ever drop anything? Just useless. Whoa, lag fast. What does it say? It says trap ahead. Yes, I know. Although I nearly activated it again, because I kind of forgot. So we can warp from here. Um, what was the other thing I had to do? It was uh, head to... So this is Undead Parish. Bonfire, that's what they're called. Bonfire. Campfire. Potato, patata. Tomato, tomato. So we can warp anyway to An Orlando. Or Chamber of the Princess, which was nearer to the... Hmm, I'm not sure. Honor Lounge was kind of far, isn't it, from the chimney breast? Although you can go from there to the castle, not too... F it's not too far. Yeah, just go there. 